heading back into the southern Yorkshire Dales now, the Wharfdale area. And it's got an amazing attraction, absolutely amazing attraction. But we're going to be heading now towards Pateley Bridge. This attraction that we will come across. In the Yorkshire Dales, you have to go down steps. You have to go through tight gaps. And it's right on the top of there. Right on the top of there is where we'll find it. Climbing back up again. And we know when we're climbing up, we're going to get to the top and we're going to see some amazing sights. All exciting stuff, isn't it? You see on the top of there? It's going to be there. Are we there yet, Dad? Are we there yet? There it is. There's the buildings. You see, what I like about coming out in this time of year, middle of September, you've seen the roads are just about empty. You can just cruise along. Wide open spaces, taking in the views, not having to worry about too much traffic. Are you ready? Are you ready to see what it is? It's Stump Cross Caverns. There's a load of bikes here already, look. How cool is that? Okay, we leave Stump Cross Caverns now and head down towards Pateley Bridge. It's a good step off pipe, that. Really good cafe and tea room. And hey! Why not take a, a trip down into the caverns? Fantastic stuff, isn't it? Here we are, heading into Pateley Bridge, surrounded by that countryside. Fabulous. You see, you don't get to see this normally in a car. Because when you lower down, but secondly, motorbikes are the best way to travel in the out. <laughs> Here we are, start at Pateley Bridge. You can turn left there and go to Housteen Gorge, up in Nidderdale. I can continue over the river Ned. <laughs> there, mate. What should we call this road? This river? Oh, let's call it Ned. And there's the guest house just there, look. So we go through Pateley Bridge. In the summer and in the weekends. It's an ant's nest of tourists. Very popular place to come to. So we're now 
now gonna head towards Harrogate. You can turn left and go to Ripon and go past Fountains Abbey or Brimham Rocks. But the route that I've chosen to do today is so you can start in either Richmond or Harrogate. So the route can be done either way. The village just outside of Harrogate called Burnt Yates. Now where has that name come from? Burnt Yates. Some amazing names of places, isn't there, in this country? Stunning bloody names, really. Hubba home, blubber houses, wet wang, I'll say that again, wet wang. <laughs> I'd love to live there. Then where do you live? I live in wet wang. And there we have some more stunning views as we head now towards Harrogate. This is only a few miles outside of Harrogate and surrounded by stunning countryside with the Yorkshire Moors right in the distance and the Cleveland Hills the Lakewake Walk Whitby and this is the roundabout at Ripley where you can either turn right of the world famous Ripley ice cream you can either turn right to go to there or straight on to go to Harrogate or turn left to Ripon, which is the route that we're taking on the A61. That is the end of the Yorkshire Dales tour. I hope you've enjoyed it. I hope that you've seen some scenery that will inspire you to want to ride around, be it starting from Harrogate and doing it the other way around, or at Richmond and doing it the way that I've done it today. Whichever way you choose, I hope you thoroughly enjoy it. Take your time, enjoy the scenery, finish the tour, and look forward to the next one. And until we meet again, take care, ride safe. Bye bye for now. <laughs>